that cooling. Monday morning, it's actually a little cooler today. This is the one. Oh, it's nice and cold. That's odd. Very odd. Cost of all the capacitors lost its phase. Not too sure at the moment. I'm gonna go inside and check it out there first. It's cold at the moment. This one got away easy. It's just the heater valves. So turn off the heat. There we go. It was nice and cold. Oh. It's rattling a little bit. Sometimes you can just put a little something in and stop the rattling. Alright. I'll check the capacitors on the roof, make sure I have a good summer, but that's that. Alright. Just the heater goes. Nice and cold. Oh. Good there. Okay. Got away easy on this one was just the heater valves. I have two other air conditions down, but I, while I'm here, I just want to have a good summer and I'm go ahead and check the capacitors here. And just stay ahead of things, so pull the disconnect. And uh, yeah, it was weird. I knew it was getting cold, but it was just the hydronic valves, no big deal. Check it here. It's a pretty new unit here. Well, it's got a hard start kit. I'm going to discharge the capacitor. The capacitor holds a charge in it even after the power is disconnected. So we're bridging the leads. Holding only the insulated portion of the screwdriver. Here's the fan, 5 and common wires, hard start kit. Start wire. The other side of the hard start kit. that up after. Okay. And this is probably a 40 slash 5. They always like to rotate these to the QWERTY as if everyone's got a cell phone that they'll just take a picture and research that. I like to put them where you can read what the darn thing is. I'm also going to go ahead and label it. It's a 40 slash 5 and it's a 440 actually it looks like the original so I like that I like using the 440s much better so we've got a 40 slash 5 40 slash 5 okay and I just like to mark it for the next guy it just makes it easier on uh, when you have different units especially all my other old Older janitorial units are 35 fives. I don't bother marking those because. Unless the compressor was changed. Yeah, I just got a bunch of those, a lot of those. I don't know what they are. So. Okay, so here we go. Um, again, we've already discharged our capacitors. The, the Herm is here, the Commons here. So here's the Common and the Fan. And we're looking for five. Um, I 
getting any reading. Reset my meter here, I'll see again. 4.84, that's not bad. And then the 40, we're going comma to Herm. 39.04, we're good. All right, I'm uh, just glad to have checked it. Wanted to just make sure I have a good summer. Okay, so the capacitor, one side goes to Herm and one side goes to Common. The heart circuit, one side goes to Herm, one to Common. Common goes Herm. And then for these Goodman units, it's a yellow start wire. It goes by itself on the Herm. Okay. The yellow by itself on the Herm. And then the brown goes to the fan also by itself and then the other two go to common so we've got a red going to the common and purple going to the common nice and easy okay and now we're all set I can go ahead and plug it back in contactors pulled in contactor looks really good there Back up right away, everything's good. I'm going to go ahead and set my cover on the deal. Keeping the moisture and stuff out of there. Oh, look, I found the, the cover plate. I'd like to make that better. That's my favorite kind of disconnect though. Those ones uh, I have very little problems with them. I hear a lot of horror stories about other people's disconnects and I'm always I'm leery to change those because um, they, they're so good. One AC down, two to go this morning. All right. Nice, beautiful, little cooler morning. I'll take advantage of it now and get after these air conditioners. Keep everything good. Thanks for watching Kung Fu Maintenance. I got away easy on this one. Hope you liked it.